Many haven't still come to an acceptance that AKA is no more. It is a very disturbing and a heartbreaking situation. There are some videos that are meant to be posted and watched. There are some that are meant to be posted and consumed. Hey Mzansi, if you are watching this video right now, then you are about to know the 5 top things to know about AKA's memoir plans. A memoir that he had everything secretive. He didn't actually reveal this to the public. He had so much he wanted to accomplish in life, but unfortunately, the cold hands of death had to claim him from us. It is a huge robbery for South Africans. Make sure you watch this video right up to the end and share so you get to understand the details of what the iconic rapper aka wanted for himself. Before I give you all this information proper, you're welcome to my YouTube channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video, drop a comment and hit onto my post notification bell. On the eve of Mass Country being released, the fans of AKA Kiernan Forbes learned of another project he hoped to work on, a book about his life. And according to the author Kanyad Langa, the rapper had plans to share his rise to fame story in a memoir. In the top five things you should know, first, when was the idea born? According to Kanya, AKA approached him on the 11th of February 2022, almost a year to the day before his death, about plans to write a book. What is it about? Kanya claims that AKA wanted a book to be about colored identity, being a hip hop crossover artist, and how he was accepted by black white and colored communities in South Africa without any hate. He loved his fans. The book would also feature AKA's privileged background, going to a private school, St. John's College in Gauteng, and of course, how it impacted his life in a great deal. Next, who was going to write it? AKA wanted Kanyad Langa to write a book about his life. Although he was initially hesitant, but he admitted to being intrigued and later interested. And AKA promised to give him all the props. Inasmuch as AKA's name will be on the rise, Kanya's name as well will be on the rise. The plan was for Kanya to record AKA talking and later transcribed the best parts. Kanye revealed this would begin after April 2023 when he had finished his own book. What is the title? The title is Infamous. Infamous. The title was the brainchild of AKA who was explained the reasoning behind it. According to Kanye, in would be in brackets as in inside fame because I live in fame and everything I do is in it, said AKA. AKA wanted to express that part of his life that many people don't naturally see on a daily. He was a famous musician and an icon to so many. Is it still going ahead? At the end of his Twitter thread, Kayat Langa posted and I quote, I really thought there was time, but time does not belong to us, hinting that the book may never come to pass. This has broken the heart of so many people who definitely want to experience AKA's life through this book titled In Famous. However, fans of AKA have insisted that the talented author go ahead with the book with consultations from the rapper's family instead of AKA's. Hence, he will still have an insider detail about how AKA lived his life. This was a heartbreaking one, heartbreaking situation, and so many fans are feeling really, really down because they all wanted. I mean, in as much as they didn't expect it, they all thought that is going to be a lovable experience having a memoir of AKA's life. Of course, that's going to serve a great deal to keep his legacy alive. It is a very saddening moment right now for South Africa.
You will tell me what you think about these five aspects of AKA's unreleased memoir. I love you all so dearly.